Stop! Stop! No! Reload! Oh, you poor, poor thing. He went missing. We heard nothing, no bodies, no anything for a solid year. Figured he had died out there in those woods. Guess we were wrong. Turns out he's back. See, the mountain man is a different type of killer. He doesn't just do it for fun. He doesn't just do it for, oh, whatever other reasons that you might think a killer would do it. He does it as sort of a sport. He takes a sick pleasure. We're dealing with an apex predator. All right, so the mountain man killer is back and it looks like the police are already hot on his trail. They're currently looking for the body of the first guy I just killed right now. Oh, three, five, two. I found the body is gonna be. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, they just found okay. his body. He's like hacked up by an axe. You said there was a note. There was a mount note. Yeah, it's something like uh, the mount will. Let me read it again. I don't have a good memory. Yeah, the man will. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Lovely. It's a good. It's a good sign to find a uh, uh, note on a dead body out sure in the wilderness like this. Uh, we'll just wait for the investigation units to come up here. Yeah. Hey, do you guys remember about a year ago there was like, some killings up in these mountains? About a year ago there was like this mountain man killer uh, that went around killing. We never found him. Uh, he he went into hiding. I think maybe he's out of hibernation. It I'll might be him. There. Let's see if can see anything up there. Wait, yeah, if you want to check around, scars. see if you can find any footsteps or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. They're going to be looking around for some uh, evidence of where the mountain man came from and went. Two steps going downhill. Um, no weapons or anything. This is weird. I am not liking it. It's going to be time marks as well. All right, so Jip Thornville has returned to Sandy Shores after months of a uh, hiatus. Be going around. Trying to make some friends. We're going to be carrying on our uh, tradition of going ice lake fishing and uh, see how it goes. Hello, sir. How can I help you? Ah, uh, yeah. What can I, I help you with? <clears throat> uh, looking to get a oil change in my truck. Pull her into the bay here, and I'll get our counter mechanic, uh, Phil. Okay. Phil, get your lazy ass out of the bathroom. You got a, you got, you got a customer. I put my truck in the uh, the bay there. You said. Yep. Oh, I so said the bay area. All right. Um. Phil, get your ass out of here. You got a customer. Hey, uh, you don't happen mm -hmm. to like going, uh, fishing, do you? Oh, uh, yeah, I do like fishing. I'm actually, uh, trying to get me and my friends to get together and go hunting for a shark sometime because, uh, about three months back, I got my leg taken by a shark and I have a prosthetic oh, really? leg now. Huh. Yeah, you know, yeah. I was just a little, I was curious to know if you, uh, you and I want, uh, 
you wanted to come with me tonight, go uh, ice lake fishing. Ice uh, lake fishing? Yeah, it's a tradition I do every year. Hmm. I'm not sure. Um, business seems a little slow. Uh, when are you, when are you thinking of doing it? If I may ask. Well, I gotta go get the, I gotta go get the uh, the worms I need, all the bait. All right. I gotta go get the rods too. I only got one rod right now, but uh. All right. I got my own rod in my truck, so I should be fine. Oh, that does not sound healthy. What the? That did not sound healthy. Oh. After I get my oil change, I'll go get the the, uh, the rods and all that stuff. Jesus! Dude, what is, why is it sound like World War Three going on? What the hell? What is going on in this town tonight? Well, uh, yeah, Phil should be attending to your truck uh, now. So, uh, do you truck, want uh, my number or anything so you yeah, can maybe yeah, contact what, me? Yeah, all right. What's your uh, all right, sir. It seems that Phil uh, finished up your with your truck. Oh, did he? Yes. It's all good. Yes, it's all good and clear. Okay. Right, tell when, when do you get off work? Uh not sure. Uh give me a call when you're uh when you're uh ready and I'll uh I'll probably I'll, I'll probably be off work by then. Alright, it's a pleasure meeting you, sir. Take pleasure care. Oh too. my what's the flying fuck? Oh that's my cue I gotta to leave. handle that, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That. yeah, you go take care of that. <laughs> Somebody keeps driving into the pumps. Oh my god, what happened? I'm over the trucker. Oh! 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 Shit! Oh! Oh! Dear, I don't think karma's on my side. Not today. Sir, yeah, you okay? I'm all right. Oh, all right. Your Ugh. truck looks fucked. Are you sure? You need any medical attention? This is my baby. Uh, oh, my head. Uh, you two, go ahead and call the police. No, no, uh, no police. You okay, needed. sir? You weren't seriously injured in that crash, were you? Uh, I think I hit my head a little bit, but it's all right. All right. Get that light out of my fucking I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call the police. No, no, not needed. Just hold on over. The roadie. No oh, need for the police here. Police. I don't need no doctor. I don't need no police. All right, just, just roll my it. truck on over. Right up here. Just roll my truck on over to the garage over there. Sir, uh, sir, get you need light to, out you of my eyes. Speak to the police. Three. Hey, whoa, whoa. Get that sir, light out of my eyes. What are you doing? Why do you not hey, want the light sir, in your eyes? Are you okay? under the influence of any illicit substance? I just got into a car accident. Guys, 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 gentlemen, gentlemen, you back away from me. Sir, sit, sir, can you step down across the street? All right, sir, I got a med bag out here. God damn. My poor baby. Sir, are you are you bleeding anywhere? Are you feeling feeling okay? Alright. I'm doing alright. I took a nasty hit there. Oh god, more police showing up. Not good, especially that I'm keeping off the radar with the fake name. I can't have the police getting to know who I am. Alright, sir, it looks like uh bandaged up your head there. Are you sure? I got some of the good stuff right here. Yeah, I I got good stuff. This is what they used to issue before the FDA. Alright, sir, stuff. I already have him covered. All right, I understand. Don't want any help from the community watch. I don't get any respect. I, I don't. I don't need a doctor or anything like that. Simple little accident, okay? Are you sure? So it seems like uh, I'm on a little accident. All right, sir. You never well, been in a car accident be... before. I've been in many. Yeah, so these are normal. So pretty much. I do your little report, whatever, but. You have uh, vehicle rentals over there at your your store over there? Nah, no, unfortunately we do not. You could probably find one from the junkyard, like an old junk car or something. Okay. Blind fools run around with their eyes full of greed. I know, dear, I know. So I get a new vehicle, get right back on track. I promise you. Spent a few months out of the loop, up in the mountains. I know. Jacob Marfer is the way. Excuse me, uh, 
What's up? I heard you, uh, you have some discount vehicles here for purchase. Is that true? Discount vehicles here for purchase. Uh, uh, there's probably... You like have vehicles for sale here? I could probably get you, like, a Junker Miata or something. Whatever, uh... Whatever it is you got for cheap, right, around uh, the five grand range. Five grand. All right. Wait. Yeah. Right here. Oh wow. Give me a Mercedes. Oh wow. All right. Here you go. Not even the missus yeah. had one of these. Yeah. This has just been a wow. been around. Okay. Yeah. Uh, How we much? Don't use it much. So, I uh, just say two grand. Two grand. All right. Yeah. Here you go. Looking through the old evidence we have from a year ago. Okay, yeah. Um, Oliver, read that note off again for me that you found. Yeah, hold on. A mountain will run. Blood red. Blood red. Uh, Where are you? Come on. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's Bunch of notes from last year. Each okay. one of these was found at the scene of a killing. All done by the same man. Alright, let's let me have a look through them. So I'm assuming he probably drenched the papers with gasoline so there's no fingerprints. So that's, that's probably bleach. The, bleach yeah. the bodies were unidentifiable, unfortunately. We got the slippery son of a gun. So, we got so him last year. So you think it's the same guy? So you think it's the same guy? I mean, if the could wordings be. in the letter match, I would assume so. Yeah. Well, let me tell you a little something. About a year ago, we got the guy. Got him. Locked him up. We had yeah, him. but how many he people escaped. did he kill before he before we actually caught him? He escaped from the prison, but he was old, he was weak. He went missing. We heard nothing, no bodies, no anything for a solid year. Figured he had died out there in those woods. I guess we were wrong. Yeah. Turns out he's back. You think he'd be a they cop cat? He's gonna know all of our place now. That's gonna be the problem. How m like, how many people did he kill last year? I don't even remember. I think it could be a copycat, though. No, this is no copycat. No one does things like he does. Yeah, the, you should have seen the body, man. It, it was brutal. Like, it, 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 I almost had to throw up, man. Um, <clears throat> all right, so it's, it's probably not a copycat. The issue is. Uh, right now, uh, he's going to be smarter this time. He's going to be uh, looking closer behind his shoulders. He's already an uh, escaped convict. Uh, so we're going to need to be careful. Uh, we're going to need to be stealthy on how we operate. Make sure he doesn't uh, catch on that way onto him. You see, the mountain man is a different type of killer. He doesn't just do it for fun. He doesn't just do it for, oh, whatever other reasons that you might think a killer would do it. Just it as sort of a sport. He takes a sick pleasure in watching his witness his victims die right in front of him. He's an apex predator. Like a wild animal. That sounds like a book I've read where a guy would kidnap people and have them battle against each other and watch them die. Uh, no. He does it himself. Watch the life drain from their eyes. He's a sick monster. The way he does things is unpredictable. Right. Well, Sergeant, if you want to call a meeting down for every deputy and other officers, so they're all going to be... Yeah, we'll bring uh, them down. 427 to all available units. All available units. We have a situation. I need everyone down here to the Sandy Shores PD as soon as possible. You're going to want to see this. All right, basically, it's just a map of San Andreas, right? Or Sandy right. Shores. What you're looking at here is a map of Sandy Shores. Now, let me grab some things here. All right. I'm sorry uh, I called you all here at short notice, but... We have a bit of a situation going on here. I don't know if you remember one year ago, we had a series of killings over by the mountain. Let me get these out. Oliver, I'm gonna give these to you. Pass these around. Yeah. All right. All right. These were a bunch of notes left by a bunch of bodies that were left exactly one year ago today, all throughout Blaine County and nearby the mountain. Here you go, guys. Take one and pass one. If anyone on. was on any of the cases last year, tell me if these look familiar to you. Uh, if you the look here on the was... map, you'll see. It was over here by the lumber yeah. yard. It was a bit further up in the mountain, uh, but yes, in the lumber yard area, so we think we might have come from there. 
So this dead body, it was brutalized. He had a note on it. Uh, the note was say, uh, said, let me, hold on, let me read it real quick. The mountain, yeah, the mountain will run blood red. Yep. The mountain will run blood, blood red. Only so, one person um, I know that would leave a note like that next to a brutalized body. So the sergeant over here recognized the type of uh, lingo on that note right away. Uh, Gentlemen, to, uh, I hate to inform you, but he's back. Who? The mountain man. He's back. What's a mountain and this man? time, oh, you don't know he's the mountain man, do you? He's, he was a serial killer about, that appeared about a year ago. Uh, we managed to catch him, apparently. Uh, however, he ended up escaping prison. He ended up escaping prison, and when he did, he was already old, weak. He's an old fella, probably in his 70s. He ran off back into the woods. We had assumed most likely he had dropped dead sometime after he uh, escaped prison. Went missing. Full year, nothing. Until today, a body showed up near 3002, brutalized with a note. The mountain man is back, back to his old ways. Which means, I want everyone here on high alert. Do not underestimate this man. He's not your average killer. He understands this mountain. He knows the landscape better than me, better than my grandfather, better than my entire family line. We grew up here. He knows this mountain better than all of you. And he knows how to use it to his advantage. And hunt you all down. Don't forget that. Every time he leaves a body behind, it's in vastly different areas. So I'm suspecting the next body that comes up it's gonna be an entirely different postal code. Out of the 3000s. Probably gonna be somewhere near Grapeseed. He does it differently so we can't track him. I want people patrolling in Grapeseed. Go, now! What are you standing around for? Go, get going! Yes, patrolling Grapeseed! Hey, 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 yes, guy, you're staying with me. Hey, Sarge. Patrolling twos! Hey, I don't want any more bodies showing up! We got a case in this guy already. Yes. We got a description of the guy. I'll, I'll put it over the radio. For anyone looking for a description of the guy, an old man, short hair. Uh, yeah. No, I have. Jaw, I have a count right going right now. I'm investigating uh, the unit. White hair, black glasses. The guy who sold me this car. Windows are completely blacked out. This is almost like a perfect fit for what I need. All right. They should have some bait in here. Is she mine? Hey, that's a pretty cool car, man. Oh, thanks. Oh, you, uh, you ever gone, uh, ice lake fishing before? Uh, no. No, I... Yeah. I've, I've always wanted to try it, though. Yeah. You know, I might be going tonight if you're interested. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, I'll, I'll be interested, man. Yeah. What's your number? Uh, I'll give you a ring. Out. Yeah, I'll give you a ring. It's a yearly tradition I go out and go fishing. I try to invite locals who haven't done it yet. Oh, uh, yeah, call. man. I've lived in San uh, so, so uh, long. Alright, so uh, give, me, give me a call, man, if you're going fishing. I'll, uh, I'll bring my rod. Yeah, I'll let you know. Oh, he ain't working. Hey, it's me. Hey. Hey, uh, I got the supplies. Uh, you, uh, are you free? I'm currently not, unfortunately. Uh, I might, I might be heading out of state. Heading out of state? Yeah, I might be soon. I mean, it'll, it'll only take a little bit. We'll go for like 20 minutes and I'll let you go. How about that? Uh, all right, uh, can I give you a quick call back? Yeah, yeah. I just realized my sunroof is open. <laughs> what is Chip doing? Hello? Hey, hey man, it's, uh, RJ. Uh, I, I think I'm just gonna, I'm just, I'm gonna can, I'm suddenly gonna cancel, uh, there seems to be, uh, Serial killer going around. Uh, I I'm not too sure if it's uh, safe or not. Serial killer going around on the oh, news, shit. and uh, I I don't feel comfortable with uh, man, that who, who going out on the ice uh, with that. Uh, I've been kidnapped too much. Wait, what are you talking about, serial killer? 
the, there was a serial killer on... All my friends have told me that there's a serial killer going on the loose right now. Well, just take your phone with you. We'll, we'll go for about 20 minutes and we'll bring you on back. You have those uh, tracking things, right? The, the tracking apps? Yeah. Yeah, th honestly, you know, I I have this diagnosis. I, I you know, I, I might die very soon. And uh, it'd mean the world to me if someone just came out with me and go, you know, I just like fishing. I used to do it as a boy and, you know, I just, you know, I'd hate to, you know, right. go by myself. After my wife passed, it's been hard on me, and I always like to take people out with me. I am, uh, I, I'm terribly sorry. Ah, ah, excuse me. Sorry about that, sir. Um, you know what? I'll go, f I'll go fishing. I'll have my phone with me, so uh, we, we should be all good. Yeah. I think I I'll, I'll give it a shot. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're I'll grab my uh, truck. Uh, I'll drive out to you. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, where do you want to meet up? Hey, RJ, how you doing? I'm doing pretty fine. How about yourself? I'm doing. Uh... <coughs> Getting old sucks. Let me tell you. Yeah, I bet. I mean, I, I, I'm probably, <coughs> probably young buck. I'm only 23, so. Well, you know, I got you know, about 30 minutes and I gotta go back home. I'm watching my stepson right now. So, uh, you know, it'll be a quick little thing. So, uh, why don't you, uh, come help me grab this bait here. Alright. So, we gotta go out in the center of the lake here. Uh, is it safe to take my truck across or no? I wouldn't. It's, uh, it just yeah. started freezing over. You don't know how much weight mm. it can take. Ah, uh, good point. So, you know. A hundred pounds each of us isn't as bad as the, you know, four or five thousand pound vehicles gotcha. going across. So you say you're dying or something, is it can't, uh, not, <laughs> is it, um, something internal? Yeah, you could say that. I'm not right. talking about it. No, no, it's fine. I, I have respect for you. Just getting old is, uh, you know, like they say, uh, I don't know who said it, but... You know, the second you're born, your age is on a clock. Yep, that it is. That it is. Your entire life is just flashing before your eyes, you know? It was just like Every yesterday second. I felt like I was your age. And, uh, you know, I blink and here I am now. Going about 68 now. <coughs> Ooh, it's cold out here. Yeah, it's pretty chilly. I'm actually pretty warm and comfy in my, uh... My work gear. Oh yeah, you could have brought some uh, more layers. That's fine. I'm pretty warm. All right. Uh, I like to go a little farther than this. See the fish? The fish don't like to stay near the coastline. They like to go in no, the middle. No, they don't. They like to be out and about. Yeah. So, luckily we don't need a boat. We just walk on over here with our legs. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. Oh, RJ is so sus of me right now. Tool here. Cut open right. the ice and then we'll put our uh, rods on down there. Here, if you want to take gotcha. the bait, put them on the rods. All right. So tell me about yourself, RJ. Yeah, I work for uh, Race Towing and uh, I own a bar on uh, LS on the uh, pier. Well, mm. full hole and bar. I enjoy it a lot. I, uh, I used to live around here my wife but uh we we moved out quite a long time ago we uh we moved up on the mountain you see the mountain has been a integral part of my life i uh my wife moved my wife and i moved up into the mountains we had this cute little cabin hmm. you know about 15 20 years ago Oh. It's just like yesterday she passed. I'm uh, I'm sorry for your loss there, sir. Uh, yeah, it must be difficult to deal with. Yeah, you know, uh, it's never easy getting over loss. No, no, it's not. Unfortunately, I've 
I've had quite a few friends and family have died in the past. Yeah. You know, you, you figure once you've seen it once, you can get over it, but it doesn't get any easier. <sighs> yeah. Memories still stick around. We were planning to have a kid. Hmm. And, you know, we... She got pregnant after a few months, and then... Just like that, it just, you know, vanished. Ruined our marriage, almost. And I don't know, just after that, it felt like nothing was right after that. It's been a hard time. I... I can relate in one way or another, sir. Uh, not to that extent, but I can definitely relate to a lot of heartache and troubles. I miss my wife. She, I, I'm sure you miss her every day. But she has become something much bigger than herself. Mm -hmm. I feel like she almost is a part of nature at this point in her life. Oh, yes, dear. I know, dear. Mm -hmm. I know. You doing all right, sir? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm doing fine, my... You seem to be... Are you, uh... You seem to be talking to yourself over there. Oh, no, yeah, no, I... It just, it just happens at my age, you know. Oh, crap, crap! Oh, my... What? Oh, my fishing oh. line. Oh, shit. It completely ripped off the... Oh, the cheap poles. I think I got it. Oh. Uh, okay. All right. Oh, oh, boy. I think the fish is still on there, is it not? Yeah, she's, she's heavy, man. Practically snapped. All right, all right. Are right, you start tugging that? Hold on. Let me see if I can get another little bit. Yes, dear. I know what to do. I know. Oh, oh my God! This thing is heavy. Attention, residents. I think it might be frozen up or some this is a shit. Stay at home advisory. I say again, this is a stay at home advisory. It's dangerous to be outside alone. Do not answer the door for anyone you don't know. Do not accept rides from strangers. If you see something suspicious, report it to bcso.gov. Are you hearing or that? Call 911. I don't know what he's talking about. Stay at home advised if you see something, snow. Say something. Keep your doors locked and stay inside. Should we head back? Mind helping pull that line out? Get your line out too. We'll start heading I, back. I pulled my line out already, but yours seems to be really stuck like it's frozen yeah. in the ice. Why doesn't yell down for some odd reason? Yeah, I can't pull it out. It, it's stuck, man. Yes, sir. Any reason why... What the fuck? What's that? It... That... That's quite odd. There... Nah. Whoa. 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 Easy, pal. Easy, pal. I'm sorry. Listen, I truly am. My wife. Oh. Uh, ugh. Oh, shit. Damn police. Listen, my wife ordered your death. Alright. The mountains have to bleed red. Nobody takes us seriously out here. Goddamn police. Still with me there, buddy? Oh, you're bleeding all over. <laughs> yeah, you know. They've been trying to warn about me for a while. I don't know how these police keep figuring this out. <coughs> I gotta let you bleed for a bit longer. <coughs> Sorry. I'm gonna get my bag. <coughs> yeah, just, just keep panicking. It'll get more blood out that way. Alright, I'm gonna get a little sample. I'm also gonna need your arm. <coughs> Ooh. Ooh, it's getting cold out here. Alright. I think you'll do just fine here. Dear God. Is this one of your scrapyard boys? Scrapyard? Yeah, it is. Ah. RJ nice. Sullivan. Well, was RJ Sullivan? The mountains will have its vengeance. Let me see that note. 
I can almost His body's still warm. He's around here. His body's still warm. He's around here somewhere. Anyone that's I... standing around, split up and search. Hey, uh, uh Kylo, hello, right? man. Where are you at right now? I'm at 24-7. I'll, uh, I'll come pick you up, all right? How about that? Uh, yeah, I'll be waiting outside. Hey, man. Hey. Drop on hey. it. Uh, yeah. I show going out to the ass. All right, so uh, I got some bait. I got some fishing rods. I think it will go on out. Do a nice, calm little night out there. A quiet lake fishing. Ice lake fishing, I should add. Oh, uh, yeah, man, that sounds good, man. I've always wanted to do that shit. <sighs> got oh. one hole drills. I got wax worms in the box. Oh, you got, oh, yeah, they're the best ones, man. Yeah, wax worms. One of my favorites, actually. Yeah, they're real good, man. That's what I used to follow when I was on the, uh, the trail. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, but then the police officer arrested me. I had meth on me. You had meth on you? Oh, uh, yeah. I was just carrying it for a friend, you know. Uh -huh. Things get a bit iffy. Right. Yeah, yeah. so uh, uh, there's your pole. Uh, nothing's more calm than coming out here fishing. It's so peaceful, you know? Yeah. I, I cook some meat at home. You want you want some food? You hungry? Uh, yeah, sure, man. I'll be rude not to rat. <laughs> yeah. Put it in a little bag, you know. I like to have little snacks when I come out here, you know, like beef jerky. Yeah, it's always good, man. You never know, man. Yeah. I'm gonna go get it. Alright. Oh, this is tough. Oh, love jerky, yeah. man. Jerky's so good. Yeah, you know, some some types are a little thicker than others. Alrighty. Oh, what type yeah. is this? Uh, you know. Is it like. Or Bob I, think, or like that? I think they called it the RJ brand. Oh, the RJ brand. Yeah. Oh yeah, that sounds cool, man. Oh, hey, where'd you get it from, man? Oh, oh. you're real tough. Oh, yeah, I hunted it, and cooked it myself. Oh, oh shit. That was good, man. What was that, dear? Oh, what was that? Huh? Oh, nothing. You were talking to me? Oh, never mind. Hey, don't you gotta keep some, keep some for yourself, though. Yeah, yeah. Um, it still has blood on it. What? Oh crap! Sorry, I didn't clean it off that well. <laughs> You're all good, man. No, no stress, man. <laughs> Looks like a nail. <laughs> uh, but uh, is this is that a fingernail? What? Uh, there's a nail on it. Can oh. you see? Oh, that's probably just RJ. Uh, Who's that? Who's RJ? Oh, uh, you know, he was an old friend. Old friend? Go yeah. away! Oh, I gotta go get more fishing line. You just continue to fish, don't worry about it. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> nothing more, nothing more haunting than you're eating jerky from some man who takes you out to Ice Lake fishing and then you find a fingernail in it. He's just like, oh yeah, you know, it's an old friend, you know. So tell me, uh, Tyrone, you got any family? Uh, oh no, just my mountain lions. Mountain lions? Oh uh, yeah. Um, they live I with took you? them from Mount, I took them with my, from Mount Chiliad and I sold one to the fire department. You took them from the mountain? Oh uh, yeah, oh uh, yeah, oh uh, no, Mount Gordo. Yeah, from that side. Ah, uh, ah, uh, hey man, uh, 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 hey, man dear, you're a brain I know. Freeze. Oh, dear, I'm sorry. Who are you talking to, big dog? I'm oh, sorry, man. dear. I'm sorry. Did I let you down? How was I supposed to know? Hey, you got brain freeze? <laughs> you're not hot chocolate? How oh, was I supposed to know, dear? Oh, I didn't know he would take a mountain lion from you. That's okay, dear. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, dear. Hey. I hear you. I hear you. Okay. Are you all right? Yeah. It's nothing. Oh, you got brain freeze? All of us? Yeah, yeah. Oh man, I hate brain freeze. I got one of those when I was here, but flow from McDonald's. Tell me, uh, what else have you taken? Um, oh, let me think. Uh, ah, oh, I took a, I took a rock, made some wood, and yeah, that's it. Why? Yes, dear, I know. I know. Who are you talking to, big dog?
I know what must be done. How's uh, fishing going, Tyrone? Oh, what was that? How's fishing going? Oh, pretty good. Oh, God damn it. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, 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 shit, man. Hey, hey. Oh, oh yeah. It's all right, dear. <laughs> We're taking care of it. Ah. Come on, get your face Oh, uh, we got cops showing up to the body. Latest mountain man killing. What's going yeah. on, Michael? What's the note say? Read it out to me. The mountain knows no mercy to those who disrespect her. Well, that's true. The mountain knows no mercy to those that disrespect her. The mountain knows no mercy to those who disrespect her. The mountain knows no mercy to those who disrespect her. What was the note? Uh, what was the other note that he left on the last body? The mountain will have its vengeance. It's not a riddle. It's not a puzzle he's trying to make us solve. It's telling us exactly how it is. I think I know. I think I know how to lead him out. We have three bodies confirmed, each with notes left. Michael. You have the notes written down. Uh, my he has everything. I have yeah, I got all the notes written down. Sir. So, if you see right here, this newspaper here, tragedy at cliffs. One year ago today, Jip Thornville, the mountain man, killing people left and right, and he's back. At this point, we have beyond reasonable confirmation that he's him. Read me off the first note. Uh, the mountain will rain blood red. The mountain will rain blood red. Blood. Read me off the second note. The mountain will have its vengeance. The mountain will have its vengeance. And the third. The mountain knows no mercy to those who disrespect her. The mountain knows no mercy to those who disrespect her. We've been looking into this guy since last year. We're gonna have to dust off the old book from him. We already did. It appears that the mountain man as sort of a cult belief in the mountain. And I think I know how to lure him out. It's gonna be risky. We're gonna need someone who is willing not only to protect their fellow brothers, but their entire I volunteer community. Trip you. We volunteer. Trooper, what's your what's name? It's Brayden. Brayden. Let me explain mm -hmm. what's gonna go down, Brayden. The mountain man has a cultural belief in the mountain. It's like a cult following, at least from what I've seen. We're gonna take you out near the mountain. We're gonna keep an eye on you. We're gonna be watching you. I can't say you're gonna be 100% safe the entire time, but we're gonna keep a close eye on you. You're gonna be out there by yourself. We're gonna send you out there with a deer carcass. You're gonna drag it around. You're basically gonna lure him out. He's like an apex predator. He hunts, and if he sees that you're weak and alone, I'll come out looking for you. If you see anyone approach you, an old man or anything, we'll be watching you the entire time. Are you sure you're willing to do this? I signed up to protect this community. That's what I'm going to do. All right. Get your uniform off. Get something warm on. Yes, sir. As for the rest of you, we're going to be heading up near Grapeseed. We're gonna go up there. We're gonna go up right near the mountain. I'm gonna go hunting for a deer. I'm gonna bag it and tag it. We're gonna leave it on the side of the road. We're gonna send him out there unarmed, dragging the deer carcass. Hopefully that'll get the mountain man's attention. It's like it is a risky hours. operation, but the mountain man's not an idiot. We could throw our probie out there if y'all want. So, now Michael, if you have any doubts, you're free to voice them. But I need you to understand that if we do this inside the book, the mountain man's already read it front to back and he knows our playbook. He's read our playbook. That's why he's taunting us. He's putting bodies right near the PD. I'm sick and tired of this. We're putting an end to this. Can he at least be armed? Sending him unarmed is kind of... We have to send him unarmed. If we send him in there with any sort of leg holster, he might not fall for the bait. He's not going to suspect us doing this with a guy unarmed. He's not going to hesitate if he sees an unarmed man out there dragging a deer. We give him a knife, but that's it. We're dealing with an apex predator, not a gas station robber. 
He's trained. Would you like He's sniper been living in the all life. Yeah. We'll all get right, a... I'll, uh, I'll go suit up. Get a map drawn out. And then we'll get ready. Everyone, yeah. grab your gear. Get ready to head out. Oh my god. You all right? I don't know what kind of government agent you are, but assault rifle to come in handy. All right, come on, let's get the hell out of here. Hey, excuse me. Yes. Looking to uh, potentially trade in this vehicle I uh, bought from you guys earlier bought a car from us? Well, do you want something that's practical, or do you want something that's like an absolute king of the mountains? All right, is everyone ready? Yep. Bye, I lost bye, one of my friends to him. Well, we're not going to lose you to him. Remember something. You're not cheating death a third time. You're cheating Jip. Don't give him that much credit. He's not all he seems to be. Yeah, I I saw some of the reports and such from, you know, the other years when he was around. Now, just because I say that doesn't mean you underestimate him, you understand? Uh, I don't underestimate him. I don't underestimate anybody I'm with. From what we know about this guy, he hunts at night. Sun's going down. Looks like it's perfect timing. What'd you say I was doing again? Like completely uh, drag a deer around some trails or something? See if you can uh, see if you can find a deer out here. If you can, kill it. If you can't, it is what it is. It'll make it more believable if there is a deer. If you can't find one, that's fine. Just walk I'll up see. around the trails. We'll keep an eye on you. I promise you, we'll be watching. You might not be able to see us, but we can see you. Yeah, I can. I can see right now. I'll be fine. All right. Good luck, Brayden. Thank and you. Remember, he's not hunting you. We're hunting him. I got it. 427, all units, package has been dropped off. I want weather up on one laptop, a map out on the other. You, where do you want me to go? I'll hide up there somewhere. If you want me to. We're not moving out yet. That's fine. Brayden, do you see anything? Yep. What do you see? Uh, snow. Trees and grass. All right. All right. We got you on a live that, map over here. That was the what I want you to do is I want you to go ahead and take a left. Take a left until you get to the dirt road. Once you get to the dirt road, follow it west. Which way right. is left? Oh, that's a beauty of a truck right there. That's a beauty. Yeah, that it is. Of course. Go figure. Just headlights Whoa. bashed out, but. Right. Uh, I'm pretty sure so I'll you know, give you five I'm grand for it. The... Five grand for it? Yeah. All right, perfect. Uh, Mark, do you want to get him set up with the paperwork? Sure. So that way it's on file for commission for you. I think these people are very suspicious of me so far. All right. Hey, dude, I like your hoodie. Looks cozy. Just sign on uh, the dotted line. I think the beanie looks more cozy than the hoodie. I think they're both equally comfortable. I mean, yeah, I guess they have to be. This weather is nuts, man. I tell you. Yeah. Here you go. Perfect. Thank Jeez. you. Thank you, gentlemen. The car's Whoa. all yours. Digging that. Yeah. Hey, uh. They just man, gotta change that light bulb. Yep, there he goes. Ah, uh, there we go. Thank you. There now also, be you want dude. some coffee? I think we got a cut. Do we have a coffee machine back there? I think we do. We have a coffee vending. Oh god, they're checking checking the trunk of the Mercedes. I gotta get back up to where I'm going. I All appreciate right. your assistance. No problem. Yeah, watch it on those uh, watch it on those mountain roads, especially out here. You're gonna run into some ice uh, if you're not careful. So yeah. do take it Jeez, slow and steady. Weather. You know. What's the bloody oh, bag doing? The what? Oh, so, I, sorry. What, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Did you go? What am I doing? Did, did you go to the butcher? Who are you calling? Uh, my daughter, because I haven't seen her in ages. Daughter. 
I, I, I got to take this. Her head. I, gotta, I gotta take this. Alright. Did you go so to the butchers or something? Alright. Sir. Why? Did you go to the butchers or something? There we go. Uh, sure, something like that. I mean, you're there we go. Sus. I even banged out the dent for you, because I'm a living legend. Oh, that's good. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. See you around, Drive Mr. Safe. What, what did you just... I didn't even get his name. Whatever. Have a nice Marfer. day, Mr. Mar Marfer? Marfer. Marfer. Okay. Yeah. Don't forget your seatbelt. Yeah. Sounds like Bruce Wayne's uh, Thank you. See you later. Yeah, and there yeah, was a bloody was a bag, bag in, the in the trunk. There's a bloody bag in the trunk. Of course. Uh, oh, yeah, definitely walk. Of course. Ladies and gentlemen, you just sold guy. a serial killer uh, a truck. Well done. You've done you've done very well. Cool. Hey, hey, um, hey, hey. Okay. Uh, we don't assume nothing. They just found more oh, no, evidence of uh the what I did to the previous guy. They just found more evidence of what I did to the previous guy. Twitter and the fact that he was on literal file. That's a nice guy. <laughs> because I had to check yeah, over the morgue and sir, after he was uh, arrested. Cool. Oh, Somebody oh. call 911 or not. So, oh god, the police are here. helping any Miss Pissy. He just left in like an old ass 50s era like Ford truck. 50s, 60s era Ford truck. Actually, that's a 78 crew cab. You guys happen to know the name of the guy who was this supposed killer? Because he did sign, he did sign the paperwork. Jacob Marfer. Okay. Okay. I don't know at all. Jacob Marfer was the guy's oh. name. These are people. Jacob the guy Marfer. we're looking for is a Chip uh, Thornville. Okay. Who? So Chip Thornville. Why, is, why does Irish that sound like a fake name? Right, hey, guys. Can I get the name that you said, Mark? Jacob Marfer. 574 Can you please arrest Jacob that Marfer. man? He just assaulted him. Uh, okay, oh. they're figuring out that I used the fake I alias. The police now know Jacob Marfer is Chip Thornville. Alright, not a guy. You guys have right, a description of the vehicle um, to go on now. You weren't free of criticism yeah. either, Ruby. Yeah, you you knew it when I that. didn't. Uh, and you decided yeah. to not say anything. I'm, well, I'm not like... sure. I get back up to the cabin. I know, dear. I know. I'm coming. I'm coming home, dear. I won't let anyone disrespect you. That, that day, so many years ago. Darling, I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. You didn't deserve that. You deserve so much more. Hello? What is this guy doing? Hey, how you doing there, bud? Oh. Uh, hi. You alright? No, no, I'm not, not really. Oh, what? Where, where are you heading right now? Uh, I was, I was heading over to, uh, I was heading over back to my house over in Grapeseed. All right, well, why don't you hop on in? I'll take you over there. Uh, uh, okay. Hey, I gotta say, this is a this is a really nice truck, man. Yeah, thanks. I had it for a while. That's weird. Hey, I, I didn't actually catch your name, by the way. My name? Yeah. I'm Jacob. Jacob Marfer. Jacob Marfer. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm. I'm Braden. Go ice lake fishing or something, you know. You uh, you got family? Yeah. Uh, I do, but they're they're back in Liberty. What the hell? What the? F oh, you getting pulled over? I don't know why it would be. Yeah. Uh, well. What the hell? Hell? What's going on? Really? I think something's going on down there. What is going on? I don't know, man. What the? The fuck? What the hell? What the? What the hell? Shit. Jeb, this is Sheriff Redfield. Step out of the truck, or you will be shot. What the fuck? How the hell do they know? I don't know what he's talking about. Play games like this. Shit. Thornville! If you reach for anything, you're gonna be shot! 
Don't do it, Thornbill! All units, hold fire. We have to confirm. No one fire until I give the order or if he shoots at you. Hold fire. Darling, I'm sorry. Looks like they got me Jim, pinned. We know it's you. The game's over. Come on out. You're done for now. Jip, it's just us now. Get out of the truck. Chip, don't do it, Chip! Officers down, officers down, he's out in the ice. Ah. the way I chose to go out. If it means I'll bring blood to the mountain, then I'll do it. Uh, nearest postal 2007. Do not pursue on the ice. Chip, don't do it, Chip! Christ! Don't do it, Chip! It's not worth it! Not worth it, Jeff. Nearest postal is gonna be 2007. He's armed and dangerous. It's over for you, Jeff. Backup's already showing up. It's it ain't over worth yet. It. It's over for you, Thornville. We've got you. Remember, he knows the mountain. Watch yourselves. Do not go alone. I got eyes on it. Stop, Thornville! I don't want to have to shoot ya! Come on, Thornville! Thornville! Darling, I'm from Come on! Stop this! I know this mountain, Thornville! I know it! I came so hunting I. here with my grandfather every summer! I know this mountain like you do! me, Thornville. I want to protect it, too. Stop, Thornville. Drop it. Come on, Thornville. You know anything about the mount. And now put the game. Check. Up. 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 Thornville, if you want to be alive to protect the mountain, you got to drop the gun. It's okay, darling. Uh, I could get out of this just fine. I don't care how many badges I have to take. Oh. Four, two, seven. Fiddle down the mountain, I'm all right. Watch yourselves. Thornville, you better stop. You're surrounded, Thornville. Thornville, I know this mountain. I know you want to protect it. The mountain will not show mercy on those who disrespect it, Thornville. So let me see some hands. Drop that weapon. I understand, Thornville. Thornville, I know the message. The mountain will not show mercy to those who disrespect it. I get it. You've been reading If you want to be alive, if you want to be alive to protect the mountain, you gotta drop the gun, Thornville. What do you know about this mountain? I know a lot about this mountain. Do you have any idea the sacrifices that I've made to this mountain? Thornville, I came to this mountain every summer with my grandfather. I don't give up. Shit who you came to this mountain with. I lost someone very dear to me on this mountain. So did I. She I lost to my grandfather. Mountain. You don't get Not it. Not true. You don't get it. She we didn't is do the it. mountain. At least Varmin. My grandfather oh, died in this mountain, Thornville. Think He's you know the mountain everything too. about me. Well, you got a little case file on me. Yeah. You gonna throw me back in prison? I can just walk back out again anyways. Huh? Think what do you want to do, you. Thornville? Do you want to protect this mountain? Or do you want to die here on it? I want to split. I just want to spread so much bloodshed. Oh, throughout this mountain. 
Why, Thornvilk? Why? Because she Whole radio comes. demands it. Who demands it? My wife. When she died, I've been giving her the blood. She's so quenched. Thornville. She was I need so you to listen mad to me. at me. I need you to listen. She was so mad at me. Thornville! The day I killed her. Why'd you do it, Thornville? Why did I Come on, Thornville, drop it! If you want to protect her, you gotta drop it. You can't do it when you're She's dead. already dead. What am I protecting? You're the one who wrote it. Those who disrespect the mountain will not be shown mercy. She comes Every to me in I visions. Come here, I she comes to me now. in visions. And I hear everything she wants me to do. She's so angry with me. For the day she of died. Are. She didn't want to go. But she had to go. It was her time. And now she comes to me in these visions. And she says to me that I have to spill blood. Otherwise, I will be haunted until my dying day and even the afterlife. But now, even I have realized what this means for me. The amount of blood I spill here or the next place won't matter. I'll have to get more blood to fill tomorrow's quenching. I'm like a hamster on a wheel. Honey, I'm home. No, Thornville. Don't do it, Thornville. Thornville! I'm coming home! Stop. Thornville! Thornville! Stop! It's over! Nothing's over! It's over, Thornville! What do you want to do now? There's nothing left! Thornville! Thornville! I love that there's something everywhere for me. 427, all units. We lost him. He's somewhere on this mountain. He's up here with us somewhere. Negative. You can't bring air units up. It's a blizzard. It's a whiteout. Thornville! We know you're up here. I'm coming home. I'm coming home, dear. I don't know about that. I'm coming home. I'm sorry for that day. That horrible day. Get you on to me. Oh my god. In chat, they just realized I killed RJ. All the pieces are slowly coming together. I ain't leaving this mountain without a damn fight. Every message I've ever written, the bloodshed shall rain from this mountain. The mountain shall bleed from the blue. All my messages show them how serious I am. I got a supply box. Supply box. Oh, Jesus Christ! We got a bunch of men down here. It was booby trapped. It's a booby. He's got the mountain booby. <laughs> the mountain's booby trapped. <laughs> Stay hey, here and watch them. Stay <laughs> here. Spit flying at him. It's hey, booby trapped. He turned around. No, I scream and then just. I'm gonna put you in the dirt, Thornville. Go left. Up here. Where are you, Thornville? Thornville! You're outnumbered! Hey, slow down, I'm not slowing down until he's in the dirt! He's got it rigged to blow! Don't come up here! Stay back! All units, stay back! Lost my gun! You want mine? No! I got this! Jesus! Thornville! I can give you a backup. 
Walk, walk very carefully. Only hey, walk. Hey, how's that over there? Oh! Ah! Thornville! All right, Piggy, let's play. Back off the mountain! Retreat off the mountain! Shit! All units, get off the mountain! He's got it, Rick the... Get off the mountain! Go! Let's go! Retreat! The mountain shall bleed blue blood. I will not stop until this mountain is covered in red. You hear me? I'm not stopping. I will paint this mountain red. You hear me? Get everyone else off this mountain. You're the only one else with a gun. You need to go. Oh, got a piggy down below. Go. Come on, you think you're just gonna get rid of me like that? Come on, I own this mountain. All units, get off the mountain. He's got it rigged to blow. Get off. Think I'm afraid? Oh, who is this? Who is this? Who is this? Huh? Who is this, huh? Huh? Who are you supposed to be? Huh? Who are you supposed to be? Oh, how many burns you got out of here? Huh? I don't know, man. Come on, you can tell me how many you got. I don't know, man. I really don't. Come on, come on, tell me. Come on. I don't know anything. Come on, tell me. I guy had full, like five or ten. You got more units coming up here? I don't know. This mountain uh, is mine. I. You got a friend out here? Huh? I, I don't know. I didn't know. Thornville, that. show yourself. I got one of your units. I'm coming out, Thornville. Do it nice and slow. Let him go. Or what? You're gonna put me in cuffs? <laughs> There's a hundred units surrounding this mountain. A hundred units. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna get. I'm gonna make you the only deal I'll make a cop ever in my life. You get off this mountain right now. You tell them hundred units to get off of it. And I might well, let your friend Thornville, go here. I got something a little better for you. What's Are that? you a math guy, Thornville? Because I got a hundred units, and I only got one body bag, and you're going in it. Oh, a smooth talker. <laughs> Come on, Thornville! Shit. Shit. What are you going to do, back. Thornville? Stay back. You don't know where I am. I'm in your head. Maybe your wife would have had a better chance than you. You son of a... Show yourself! I'm not over here, Thornville. I'm over there. Darling. I will not stop until this mountain is bleeding red. I won't stop until this mountain's red. Show yourself, coward. Got one of your units. Over here, Thornville. <coughs> yeah, cough, bleed all over the mountain. That's what my wife wants. Come on. The mountain Just shall bleed go, red. Man. <coughs> the mountain shall bleed from the blue. Drop him, Thornville! Or what? You gonna put me in cuffs? Or else your blood will be all over the mountain. Come on, Thornville. Oh, I know where the mines are. Come on. Come you don't on. have enough ammo for a hundred units. You got a magazine on you? I... I... I don't know. Anything. Oh, you're useless to me if you don't got a mag on you. You got a magazine on you? Get oh! Come on, Thornville! Let him go! Come on! Oh! Shit! Drop it, Thornville! Uh, you don't know what I've been through. Come on, Thornville!
I ain't going down without a fight. Fine. You want to play that game? We'll play that game. Let's go. Oh, knife. All right. Come on. Come on, unit. Come on, deputy. Oh. 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 Come on, Thornville. I'm going to put you in a body bag. Oh. 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 Thornville! You're outnumbered! Come on, Thornville! This is it. You can't fight anymore. End of the road. End of the road, Thornville. You know, it's pretty brave of you coming up here to fight someone like me. Yeah, I'm pretty stupid of you to try to fight all of us. Tell you one thing, Thornville. You might be able to take us all on. There's one thing you can't fight. That's Mother Nature. Come on, Thornville. You're not gonna make it out here. Drop it, Thornville. Last call! Jesus Christ! He's still got the mountain booby trapped! Don't follow the main path! We gotta go! I don't know what kind of dead man switch he had on this mountain, but I don't want to stay here and figure it out! Come on! Come on, let's go! I'm not dying out here! Jesus! The remaining cops leaving Jip Thornbill's mountain. Over the years, it's completely just booby trapped everything. Who knows if this mountain will ever be we safe? Unit down over here. Ever again. Brayden! No! Come on. You, you got him? Come on, you're not dying up here. Alright, let's go. Come on, Brayden, you're not dying up here. Get you off this mountain. Even beyond Jip Thornbill's passing, who knows what other secrets are left in this mountain and what other kind of followers Jip Thornbill had. Anybody? Me. Bert. 16, I think he said minefield. 516 unit, you're breaking up heavily. Right Due to the weather. Let's go! Go, go! Major explosions, 2005, 2006. Even in that was the situation on the mount. We got off of it, and uh, Who cares? that was exploding. Drive. This is 427. This is Redfield. Thornville's dead. I repeat, Thornville is dead. We're off the mountain. Stay away from the mountain. He's got it all rigged to blow. He's got mines going off all over the mountain. Stay off the mountain. Yeah, no, I evacuated off, right? And I knew the mountain, Enjoy I knew the mountain was too steep to drive on the, um, uh, side, but the trails were wide. Sergeant, what are we doing from here? What do you think we're doing? Going back on patrol? Oh, the Normal day's day work. <laughs> Let's get back to the station. 427, uh, can we get a, uh, we're gonna need transport from Palito Bay Hospital back to Sandy Shore. Is any units available? I swear on my life, he's dead. I stabbed him. And the grenade fell onto his body and blew up. I pushed him off a cliff. He's not surviving that. Don't I know, be worried. I was watching for a little bit. Yeah. I deserve a medal of honor for that one. Yeah. Regardless of what I deserve, you know what I'm gonna get? A pat on the back. That's what I'll get. Thanks for saving the day. Go back on duty. All in a day's work.